All right, hello, hello, hello. So this is going to be a continuation series of Elden Ring on a completely new separate character that I made recently. Um, I'm going to be playing the DLC pretty much completely blind. Basically, the only knowledge I have going in is that you need to find like these shadow branch things to make you stronger against the bosses. And that's like literally all I know. Besides one of the early trailers that FromSoft released. So we're going to try it out. Commentary will be probably kind of light compared to my normal videos. Um, but we're, yeah, we're doing this new format. Should be 30 minute videos. Quality should be really high. No longer live streaming. Um, but should be a good time. Uh, play it and have some fun. See how the DLC goes. Uh, I just beat... Uh, Moog on this new character that I made. I'll get into the build pretty soon here. I start the game. I'm gonna be jumping in. See how it goes. My brother messaging me right now. Okay. Let there be light. My game is in offline mode because I imported a character from Seamless Co-op to the main game to play this, so... I'm running it in an ultra-wide mode with an ultra-wide mod. We've got some things going on. Game is... There we go. Big jittery. What's going on? Probably doesn't do this. Just try this. It's just like lagging and going crazy. I suppose it could be because I'm recording, but I have done it before with no issues. Maybe it just went back to full screen on me. Okay, maybe we're good now. That was weird. Okay, yeah, so I just beat Moog. Um, this character is level 141. I, am, I started out kind of as a... Wanting to go like a strength kind of pyromancer build. With my main weapon being some kind of axe. Um, early on I found the hand axe and looked at some of the scaling and it seemed kind of crazy. So I've been playing through the game with the hand axe and it is pretty nice. Um, I leveled strength and vigor really high. Faith. And now I'm just working on endurance to get some, some defense. And it's pretty nice. Basically, it's a it's a pretty straightforward build. Um, I can't attack for some reason. But it operates by uh, buffing my axe up a lot. With... I don't know why it's not letting me uh, do stuff. Maybe it's just because this NPC is here. Let me try and go somewhere where I can attack and stuff. And I'll show kind of how what I do whenever I fight bosses and stuff. Make sure there's nothing I missed over here. Okay. New NPC. Ah. Were you guided here by kindly Mikula? I am Leda. And like you, I was guided by Faith along his honorable path. Touch the withered arm, and you too will be transported. To the realm of shadow where Mikula the Kind now dwells. My compatriots are there already. Like us, they have heard kindly Mikula's call. If you can find them, they are certain to lend you aid. 
FromSoft always does such a good job with the way the NPCs look. Like her armor set's so cool. Come now. Touch the withered arm and travel to the realm of shadow. I will not be far behind. May we meet again. Come now. I will not okay. be Okay. In we go. Pretty excited. I've been kind of grinding on this character trying to get here. Putting in lots of hours. Okay, maybe it'll let me attack now. There we go. Yeah, so this started out as a pyromancer. Um, I haven't seen much use for pyromancies outside of flame grant me strength as a buff. So typically what I do when I'm going to fight just like a kind of a tougher enemy is I'll do electrify armament. Um, my, hacks, my axe is a heavy um, quality or whatever it's called. I um, can't remember the name of the attunement or whatever to give it the strength scaling because um, I went kind of a leaned into a strength build. So just two handing I have 595 attack power and then I, I'll i buff with electric armament. I have golden bow on the axe and then I also use flame grant me strength as a body buff. And I'll fight like this. So 969 attack power just with the hand axe which is I thought was pretty crazy because this thing's fast. So it's a really good DPS weapon. And it actually just got buffed with uh, some of the recent updates, so it makes it kind of cool to use. I've been enjoying it a lot. It's very powerful. That's what I do. It's pretty simple, straightforward, but it's been fun. Yeah, looks like first thing I want to do is probably get the map. Let's see if we can do that without getting ambushed. Rada fruit. New materials. That guy looks like business. Game's a little loud for me. I'm gonna turn it down a bit. Let's just do it on the computer. Spiral Tower of the Horn Sense.
There was a building up where I, above where I spawned, but it looks like you might have to get there from over here. Kind of what I was looking for. Something over here too. Jesus, this was unnecessarily loud. See what this guy's all about here. Peace. Crazy martial artist, dude. I don't know where to go first. Well, let's go this way. Go on this cliff. Nice, these worm guys from the trailer. Get in here. Thank you, boy. Pretty dumb of me to try and heal that much. Forgot they uh, input read like crazy and they'll just sprint right at you when you try to heal.
greatsword super armor is so annoying. Wow. <sighs> this is a tough one because he just super armors me when I attack and I do not win those trades. Try to like hit and run a little bit. Jesus. the heck oh come on so much damage and he's got a heal too great I, just, I guess I'm just going to have to play this really slow and cheesy and just hit and run the whole time. That just it hits me too hard. gonna take forever I can't believe they reached. Ah, I deserved that. Okay, he's only got one heal. 
I guess I could try and just backstab fish. Really, uh, scrape the bottom of the barrel. Just has so many stats. He just hits so hard. He is, takes no damage. I love when developers balance like that. Harder equals higher numbers. Wow, that tracking too. Oh boy. That's some serious tracking. Can't do anything to this guy. Just hyper armors everything, and I'm dead. There's not a single thing this guy doesn't have. Panic rolling. Oh my gosh, there's just no counter. I can't melee him if I'm out of range. He just hits me with his automatic, his freaking machine gun. If I try and melee him, he just hyper armors me. What the hell? Oh my gosh. 
This is ridiculous. I may just move on from this and... Uh, I don't know, maybe I need shadow tree fragments or something. Because this is just crazy. I don't want to ram my head too hard into like a boss if the fragments make it so much easier. Kind of weird design if that's the case, but... Oops. Gosh, every attack just has hyper armor. Oh my god, it's so dumb. Alright, I'm, I'm just not going to deal with this right now, I guess. I'm not even getting close. Like, literally nothing I can do against this guy right now. Alright, I guess we'll go somewhere else. That was a blast. Really enjoyed that. going here yet? Nope. 